Hey, I'm Caroline. I am the Love Mud Dog Lady, and I'm going to show you how I introduce a puppy to uh, the grooming process. So, just a short intro. The good thing is, he's been in here with his brother while his brother's had the full groom, so he's used to kind of noises of uh, bath, dryer, etc. So, uh, yeah, just going to get him on the table, do a bit of handling, maybe trim some nails, a bit of brushing, um, but just to show you my approach, uh, which may not be the absolute perfect, but it works for me. I've um, been grooming about nine years, so, and I specialise in puppies. Just trying to get up. The treats on the table make it a positive space. Let the dog explore the table, have some treats there. Um, lovely wacky tail, look, he's a happy boy. Uh, it's just really, really important that being up and elevated is good and fun and positive and generally a place a dog will want to be. Ooh, there we go. Good boy, oh, I love kisses, thank you. Yeah, good boy. Okay, so lots of handling, touching him everywhere, on the paws, but not just paws, in between the toes. Oh no, I'm having a rummage, aren't I? Oh, good boy, I like kisses, thank you. Tail, oh I know, but legs, oh that's lovely, 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 lovely. And then when he's doing exactly what I need him to do, which is just chill and comply, then um, he gets treats along the way and I get snogs, thank you. So lifting the tail up. And around, lifting the back legs, having a rummage in the toes. Good boy. Now, how do you feel about brushes? Hey, always show him all the tools as well. So that nothing's scary, nothing's a surprise. He can have a look if he wants to. What have you got? I oh, know. Oh, very wiggly. Huh? So Otis is six months old, and his uh, mum was a show cocker dad was a working cocker it's key that we start him from young i like ear kisses thank you oh, lovely well very good okay and if you start puppies from young with regular introductions they can grow to just be fine with the grooming experience so so this is just the handling or stage one puppy intro today oh no it's lovely kisses okay i will only groom a puppy in stages if someone comes to me and says will you just you know, go straight in and do a full groom on my puppy, my answer is no. Now, how do we feel about things going towards our feet? Oh, it's a fidget bum. Oh, oh, good boy. Okay, so I'm just starting to introduce. Steps to a nail trim, there we go. So something neutral that he's not used to. Good boy. Tapping on the feet. Boy, you just you just want to desensitise him. You just you need him to be oblivious to such things and not really care that you're handling or putting anything near the feet. You can be doing this at home as well. You can have your puppy up elevated with a towel. Ah, ah no teeth, thank you. Um, elevated with a towel. Just get him used to handling all over. Sounds really random, but pen. Yeah, just try to get your puppy used to having the paws handled and something foreign. Just going towards their toes, just so it's not anything scary. Let him check again. Like that. Good boy. It's just neutral, neutral things. Oh no, what am I doing? Good boy. And he's just learning that, you know, it's all fine. There's nothing scary. I'll do something and he gets something. Uh, you won't always need to do that. It's like any dog training. It's just when you're trying to shape the, uh, the um, design behavior. So. so then you can start introducing the the noise of the nail clippers. Just want him to be not worried whatsoever. Good boy. And he's a puppy, so he's excitable. He will calm down. This is his first grooming experience. Good boy. So just ignore the behaviour you don't want. Obviously a correction if he's mouthing, um, but just reward the behaviour you do want. He's a clever dog. Hey, ah, 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 ah. Bisties. Ready. Good boy. There you go. So at the minute you pair one treat with every toe, but you won't need to do that longer term. It's just so that you, um, just while you're training and teaching him. Ah, 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 ah. Wait, which one didn't I do? 
Wait. Good boy. You're very clever. Oh, you're a clever pickle. Okay, you want to get to the point where you're doing a nail and then they're looking for the treat. Where are you going? Wait. There you go. So he can bounce around all he likes, but he, he will kind of have to comply in order to get the treat. You going this way? That's all right. I can go this way. Hey, okay. good ready, ready, ready. Ah, ah, ah. Wait. Ah, wait. Good boy. I wonder if we've been taught, taught the wait command at home because the, the wait seems to be working quite well as a command. You have to work out what works for each dog. Wait. Good boy. There you go. Okay. He doesn't need the back ones done or anything at the minute, so it's just um, the key with all you know puppy introductions and experiences of grooming. Do you want to check it? Oh, good boy. Is that it's positive. Sorry, video cut off a bit early there, but yes, I was just saying that. Make sure these introductions are positive. Finish on a good note. Finish when puppy's happy, cooperative, not when they're bouncing all over the table. I hope some of you find it useful, whether you're another groomer or you're an owner. Um, key things are start puppies young and keep it positive. Um, and don't forget to follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook. Cheers, guys.